it's a little bit late, but I still have time to take photos with this thing, even though the sunrise already um, went up. But oh well. jump the fence again oh, all right so this is my bike I use this to travel everywhere in this whole video and actually let me show you a benefit of this camera you see my pocket I can just put it in there and I can just zip it because the lens is retractable so I just zip it and I have a camera in my pocket and no one will know it's very cool Guys, I found a good um, photo opportunity. Look at this. Alright guys, so I'm in the playground. I'm gonna make a quick trip here because no, it's not so crowded and I can take actually very nice photos here. Alright, let me pull up my camera and we'll take good photos. Oh, I just love that it's so small, you can just fit it in your pocket. And my pocket has a zipper, so I don't need to worry when I'm biking, it can just fit in my pocket. It won't go anywhere. Alright, so here's our first spot to take a photo. It is... Actually, I used to play here a lot when I was a child, very small child. But... See... And then, I'll show you the difference but when it's darker. Spinning this knob becomes darker. Now, if you take a photo, I know it's blurry in the screen right now, but when you take a photo, yep, here it is. Oh, no way! Let's take a photo of this one as well. I used to play here like a lot, and it's still here after like six years. It's amazing, man. Okay, let's take a photo. So yeah, I actually slid here and I fell down and hurt myself here. I was biking and, you know, I turned on the sand too quickly and I fell down. But I'm alright though, I healed. That was like six months ago. Now, you see the spinning circle behind this right zipline? Now this spinning circle, I got hurt like a million times. It is so, so painful when you hit the ground. My leg actually can't take it. Alright, so we're on the spinning thing now. Let's try to take a photo while also spinning. Let's go faster. Oh, wrong decision. This is where I almost fell down twice. I think I'm supposed to um, jump the fence, but you know, for the good photos, man. <coughs> so I went over this fence. Hopefully, I won't get scolded. But let's just walk around here, cause there's a sunrise and it looks amazing, man. I don't want to bother those two people on the rock, so I'm gonna try to go on the side here. So.
hopefully you guys can see that but I just took a photo of a very nice sunrise see here's your view of what I am taking a photo of yeah it's pretty cool actually let's try landscape now hopefully you guys can see that Yeah, so I'll display the photo on the screen of the image of this camera, so, yeah. Now, there is Coney Island. You see this, um, yeah, that's Coney Island. All right, now, this spot that I'm currently on, in right now, is blocked off. I don't know why, but when this was constructed, these two platforms to the ocean, this wasn't here. And it's actually pretty weird why they would put it when there's a platform. Anyway, so I'm in, I'm very close to the island right now. Less than a mile away, you can actually see it there. So I'm just gonna take photos with my camera because this video is all about the camera that I have. So, yeah. Alright, so we're gonna take one photo. Uh, first of all, the other side, which is there. Hopefully you guys can see that. Uh, no, hold on. There we go. There it is. Now we're going to take a photo of the island. And you see those little dots and like rectangles are very small right there. Let me zoom into that. Yeah, that's actually Malaysia. So we're in the top part of Singapore right now. Let's take a photo. Here it is, displaying on the screen. It's actually very vibrant in my view. Um, only 10 megapixels, and this is the best camera that I've ever bought. And it's ultra cheap, like $10 off carousel. Now let's make it a little bit darker, because it's a little bit too bright in my view. Now we're going to take a portrait photo, and I'll show it in the screen right now. 